Hi, I'm Alicia Malone, and I'm happy to have you for company on this spooky day as we celebrate a Halloween a thon on TCM. And next up is a fascinating little gem, a short film starring Orson Welles. Released in the UK in 1952 and then in the US in 1953, it's Return to Glenna Skoll. Wells made this while on a financially imposed break from filming Othello. Hilton Edwards is the director and writer. He was a longtime friend of Orson Welles, as well as being the co-founder of the Gates Theatre in Dublin. And Dublin is where this ghost story takes place. Orson Welles stars as himself, narrating and apologising for still having his Othello beard. The film follows his drive through the Irish country roads at night as he spots a man having car trouble on the side of the road. The man is Sean Merriman, played by Michael Lawrence, and as they drive, Sean recounts to Wells a strange occurrence that happened to him on that very same stretch of road. It's a simple story, but told economically in a runtime of just over 20 minutes, and the atmosphere is helped by the striking black and white photography by George Fleischman and a creepy score played on a harp. This short film was a big success, nominated for Best Short Subject at the Academy Awards, so also featuring one of the few film appearances of theatre actress Sheila Richards, who was also the aunt of Geraldine Fitzgerald, from 1953, Let's Watch Return to Glenna Skoll.